as a scheme member, how to log in and manage EMPF settings, and update MPF account information on the EMPF platform. You can log into the EMPF mobile app, retrieve the username and EMPF ID, reset the password easily if you forgot, and update the personal particulars of your EMPF and MPF accounts. How to log into EMPF mobile app. First, please scan the QR code or search for EMPF in App Store, Google Play or Huawei App Gallery to download the EMPF mobile app to your smartphone. Open the EMPF mobile app and tap on register, login. Then select the member tab and choose one way to log in. You can log in using your EMPF username and password, EMPF ID and password via biometric authentication or I am smart. To log in using EMPF username or EMPF ID with your password, you can first select the respective option and enter your username or ID, followed by your password. You will receive a one-time passcode in your registered email address or mobile phone number for verification. If this is your first login to the EMPF mobile app, you can enable biometric login to access your EMPF in a faster and safer way. Simply follow the instructions on the screen to add the device to your trusted device list and set up the biometric login. Then, you can use biometric login to the MPF from now on. Alternatively, you can log into IAM Smart Mobile app and follow the instructions on the screen to perform the subsequent steps. How to retrieve your username and the MPF ID if you forgot. On the MPF login page, simply tap forgot username or forgot MPF ID under the respective login method. Then you can verify your identity through I am smart or two-factor authentication. You can log into I am smart mobile app and follow the instructions on the screen. To use two-factor authentication, fill in your Chinese and English full name, date of birth, Hong Kong ID number, and your registered email address or mobile phone number. Then tap send one-time passcode. Enter the verification code sent to your selected contact method. Then, your EMPF username and EMPF ID have been successfully retrieved. Please use the username or EMPF ID shown on your mobile phone to log in. How to reset your EMPF password if you forgot? On the EMPF login page, simply tap Forgot Password. Then you can verify your identity through I am Smart or two factor authentication. You can log into I am Smart mobile app and follow the instructions on the screen to perform the subsequent steps. To use two factor authentication, fill in your Chinese and English full name, date of birth, Hong Kong ID number and your registered email address or mobile phone number, then tap send one-time passcode. Enter the verification code sent to your selected contact method. Then, you can set up a new password. Tap confirm and your EMPF password has been successfully reset. Please use the new password to log into the EMPF platform. How to update personal particulars for your EMPF and MPF accounts. You can update your personal information in both the EMPF and your MPF accounts, such as your contact information. After login, on the menu bar, tap My Account and tap Profile Management. From there, you can select EMPF Account Management or MPF Account Management to update the respective information. To update your information for EMPF, tap EMPF Account Management and scroll down. Tap Update to edit the information. If you update your email address or mobile phone number, tap Verify to receive the one-time passcode to verify the new contacts. Enter the verification code sent to your new email address or mobile phone number. Tap Save when you finished. If your updates trigger the change of your tax residency, a window will pop up. Please tap Confirm to update your common reporting standard information and upload your supporting documents, if applicable.
or tap cancel if you don't want to update the CRS information for now. Review the updated information you provided and tap submit. Read the terms and conditions and tap accept. Then, your EMPF information has been successfully submitted. On the other hand, to update your MPF account information, tap MPF Account Management. You can update the information in your contribution account, tax deductible voluntary contribution account, special voluntary contribution account, and your personal account. Please select an account to update. Tap Update to edit the information. Remember to tap Save and follow the subsequent steps. It is recommended to use the same contact information for both your EMPF and MPF accounts, since the notifications from the platform will only be sent to the contacts in your EMPF records. Review the updated information you provided, click Submit. Then, your MPF account information has been successfully submitted. We hope you found this video helpful. Ready to explore more features on the EMPF platform? Visit our website at www.empf.org.hk now.